Okay. All right. Welcome back to the next episode of Things Your Parents Never Warned You About, but they should have. What's this? Oh, old school muse. That sounds good. Tight drums and bass. Oh, now we're kicking into third gear. Or is it fourth gear? Very tight staccato style drumming right there. It goes from like tight, funky dance style to like rock anthem. Classic. What is that flashing drum that he has on his kit there? Guitar sounds straight out of the 1960s. Psychedelic. Now we're gunning into the U2 zone.
That's some crazy singing right there. Oh, that was an interesting uh, little ending there. Huh. What year was that from? That was... Okay. That was more recent than I thought. When I first saw it, I thought it was older. That's because they're ageless. Matt Bellamy doesn't age like a normal human being. Must be all that Hollywood fame he brushes up against. Who's he married to? Someone, uh, someone Hollywoodish. He is? Yes. He's, he's had his touch of uh, Hollywood mistresses, so to speak. Now he's married to someone who's famous. He was dating someone who was famous. He's all about the Hollywood starlets. L. Evans. Yes. Well, she's pretty. And I think he dated Kate Hudson before that, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe I'm mistaken. Person alive. Kate Hudson. Bellamy bought the former home of tennis player Pete Sampras. And the home said, finally, someone is not boring as hell living in my house. Stop it. Oh. Pete Sampras was a master. A master of boredom. Of tennis. That guy had zero emotion. He was basically the polar opposite of John McEnroe. Stop it. I'll take Jimmy Connors any day. Or Beyond Borg. Beyond that, I'll take Beyond Borg. Beyond Borg. Beyond Borg. I'll take any kind of Borg you got. I'll even take Cyborg. All right. Very interesting. Well, keep it up, Matt. You're kicking some ass. That's all I've got to say. Okay, I'm not speaking well today for some reason. My words are slurring. All right. Thank you very much. Have a good night, day, existence. Thank you very much.